Now, I just want to introduce you to the concept of the pillars of observability. This isn't a thing specific to Azure, but it's something that in DevOps that you need to understand. And it's just going to help you contextualize the offerings of Azure Monitor and other cloud service providers. So what is observability? That is the ability to measure and understand how internal systems work in order to answer questions regarding performance, tolerance, security, and faults with a system and application. And in order to uh, obtain observability, you need three things. You need metrics, logs, and traces, uh, and you have to use them together. Using them in isolate does not gain you a observability. So let's go define those three things. The first thing is metrics, and that is a number that is measured over a period of time. If we measure the CPU usage and aggregate it over a period of time, then we would have the average CPU metric. Then you have logs. These are text files where each line contains event data about what uh, happened at a certain time. And then you have um, traces, and this is a history of requests that is uh, that uh, is uh, that travels through multiple apps and services so we can pinpoint performance or failures. And I like to make the joke that it looks kind of like the Triforce of observability once you've constructed it there at the end.